Hello, it's Suzanne with AbsoluteConfidence.com, and I'm here again hitting the streets to bring you some great content. Today's video is going to be on the topic of self-awareness, so I'm interested to hear people's definition of self-awareness and whether or not it's important to them. So let's go see who we can find. My name's Katie, I'm 23. And you are? I'm Lori, and I'm 54. For sharing that. Awesome. So a couple quick questions for you. I'm curious what both of your thoughts are on self-awareness. First of all. Uh, <laughs> self-awareness? What do you mean? Like, What is self-awareness? It's having knowledge about who you are, knowing all aspects of yourself, knowing everything about who you are, knowing your values and your, your gifts and your talents. But yeah, what do you think about self-awareness? Yeah, I think it's just important to know um, what your personality and what your self-awareness is. And I think um, I've learned it because um, I've stayed um, abroad a couple of times and you get to know yourself better. So you know your, your values, you know what's important in life and yeah. I used to study international business and I think um, traveling and just getting to know other people and other cultures is really important. But um, because I've traveled a lot, um, I think like now it's more important for me to have a family maybe someday. And so it's changing, I think, the more experience you have. Okay, I'm curious what your thoughts are on self-awareness. Self-awareness, I think it's very important uh, for every woman, well, every being out there yeah. uh, to know yourself, know what your soul is about, what's important to you, and so on. Being true to yourself is really kind of my thing. I, you know, you do what you can to bring your self-happiness and joy. Uh, do what you love. Love yeah. what you do. Wow, that's one of my catchphrases. <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> I think it's very important to be aware of who you are and what you want in life and who you're with and who's around you and very important. Well, surrounding yourself with good friends, making sure your family is okay and yeah, just being happy and yeah, that's the key because everything is in your head like the way you, yeah, the way you think and you know, to bring on positive things and try and be positive instead of negative and that means a lot. Very yeah, true. yeah, it's huge. Any, any thoughts from yourself on self-awareness or at, at, your, at your age, is that something that, that you kind of have thought about or heard about or is it kind of a new concept to you, self-awareness? Uh, I think it means more to me now than it did when I was in high school because yeah. I think you like really grow up a lot and you realize what really matters and what really doesn't matter when... What, what really doesn't matter yes. when you're in high school? Yes, like a had... lot. <laughs> <laughs> really doesn't matter when you're in high school. Like your image and what people think of you doesn't really matter. Well, I've had to let go of a lot. I mean, you need to let go of all the things that keep you back. Letting go of the past and letting go of things that are holding you back. I mean, the past is what we are in a lot of ways right. and uh, but really the present and the future is all we have and if we can if we can concentrate on that I take yoga and that's one of the goals in yoga is to become self-realized and so I, I think it's our only real goal in life